Upon all the head-turning, mind-blowing, whatever you want to call it headlines and stories we've heard about the Tesla Cybertruck lately, this is perhaps the most head-turning slash mind-blowing one of them all. And when I read this, the first question to come to my head was how? How is it possible that the Tesla Cybertruck is now the cheapest Tesla vehicle you can get or order? But it began to make sense the more I thought about it. Hi, welcome to Everything Cybertruck, where you'll be getting all the latest updates on the announced Tesla Cybertruck. If you enjoy this video, let us know in the comments section below and why not support us here at Everything Cybertruck by hitting that like and subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the bell icon as well so you'll be the first to know each time we release a new video. It's free. Lately, Tesla has been changing its price on a regular basis, and most times the prices are always higher, and by most times I mean always. This has been due to a couple of different reasons, for instance, the global chip shortage affecting the automotive industry to date, and the COVID-19 pandemic, which is also affecting the automotive industry in so many ways. Another unfortunate outcome of the chip shortage crisis and others is the fact that if you order a Tesla vehicle today, it'll be a few months before you can get it. Not just because so many people are ordering Tesla vehicles today, but also delays as well. And so Tesla's only two operational factories can't produce nearly enough vehicles to satisfy demand. And because of these various reasons stated, prices have gone up. For example, a Tesla Model 3 which was announced to be the cheapest Tesla vehicle in the lot, now costs approximately $41,990 for the standard range model. That's a far cry from the $39,990 it cost for the standard range model during its early days. And that too goes for all the Tesla models available, they've all gotten a substantial increase in price lately. So if you're looking to go electric on a budget, and a Tesla is the only brand you want to go for, without a doubt, your best choice would be to go for a base model Tesla Cybertruck, as the base model for a Cybertruck has now become the cheapest current Tesla model to get, as of the making of this video. That is absolutely mind-blowing. The Tesla Cybertruck was announced in 2019 with a base model price of $39,900. And yes this price was striking for a truck of this capacity. With all the technological innovations in this truck and for all that it's offering, the price is way lower than what you'd get if it was an ICE or even electric car of the same or similar or even a lower capacity. Again, take the Rivian R1T as an example, with a price of $67,500 for the Explore package. This is something we covered already in our previous video, you can watch that after this, the link will be in the description. Here is why it makes sense. Perhaps the reason this Tesla cost this amount is probably because they haven't started production yet, and it's frankly still just a vehicle on paper, hence the chip shortages affecting Tesla and its other vehicle models doesn't affect this truck, I mean, the product page hasn't even been updated since the truck was announced. And speaking from past experiences, if Tesla handles things with the way it has handled things in the past, as concerns their cars, the cheapest option may take a while before we actually see it being delivered, that's even if Cybertruck has begun deliveries at the time, and maybe it could come to market with a low price for a brief time, but that low price may still not last, as Tesla will have to start dealing with production issues and a price bump might be the only feasible way for them to stay profitable. Even scarier, the base model could simply disappear completely. But hopefully, all this may just be a phase that will soon pass as Tesla gets better at production. Musk's plan is stated in his master plan is to make electric vehicles as affordable and perhaps even more affordable and reliable than regular gas or ICE cars, so that more people can transition to using electric vehicles. As you know, Tesla's main goal is to essentially fix the world from the enormous disaster that is climate change, and according to Elon, he's playing his own part to reduce the world's CO2 emissions and hopefully rid the world of its dependence on gasoline, curbing climate change in the process. That's why his master plan is to make human civilization multi-planetary. That's what his multi-billion dollar passion project slash rocket company SpaceX is for. And that's what they hope to accomplish hopefully by the year 2030. So, everything being equal, Tesla prices for Tesla vehicles will go down, eventually. As Tesla completely reimagines the auto industry in the process. But everything is not equal, at least not yet. There's a real crisis today, 
and that has affected so many industries in the world and unfortunately, the automotive industry and Tesla to be precise are not an exception. We'll like to know from you, does the Cybertruck being the cheapest Tesla vehicle to get, make sense to you now? And also, do you think the Cybertruck will still be the cheapest vehicle to get when production begins? Please let us know in the comment section below. We'll be waiting. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more awesome content like this one coming in the future. See you later.